Hello everyone, today is Sunday and actually I'm craving something sweet so I decided to make a banana bread because it's just the easiest recipe and we'll do it together but first of all I'm missing some ingredients so I have to buy it let's go together and buy it So I got everything that I needed for my banana bread, let's start the preparation. Honestly I feel like baking it's not for me because I mess everything up. Even banana bread is quite a deal for me. The first time I done it it was just perfect and tasty because I used the recipe as a reference rather than sticking to each measurement. The second time when I tried to make my perfect banana bread, I decided to measure everything as the recipe told me to and it was a total failure. So today I have like 50% chance that my banana bread will be good. Also before starting don't forget to clean your nuts. Okay let's start. So obviously we are starting with bananas, we have to peel them off and then smash. Then you would need butter at room temperature, however I have no mixer, so I decided it would be good to melt it in my microwave. So now I need to add my butter and mix it with bananas. Time to add some sugar, salt and eggs to the recipe. And so far it looks good, so mix, mix, mix. Okay, meanwhile we need to dry our nuts. Why it sounds so strange? Okay, good. Now we need to measure flour and add it to our main stuff and mix it. Actually, it's kind of ready, but I wanted to add some nuts, cranberries and cinnamon. So it is what I did. Hmm. And also I decided to make it beautiful, so I added some bananas and brown sugar. So now it's time to wait. I hate waiting, but it is what it is. Okay, so do you remember that butter? I think I added too much or didn't properly whisk it or maybe it needed more flour, but I have failed and no banana bread for me. The moral of the story is to buy the banana bread at your favorite bakery and don't complicate things. Love you, see you, bye!